Idaho Governor Brad Little is on the road today touting his new legislative goals, and he is showcasing how much Idaho accomplished during the last year. Local News 8's Linda Larson is live at Highland High School in Pocatello. Linda, what more did he say? Todd, the governor has been touring our side of the state today, and he had the chance to get up close and personal with some of these students at Highland High School, talking to them about what was accomplished last legislative session and what's ahead, what's on his agenda for this legislative session. Hi, I'm Brad. How are you? Nice to meet you. I'm good. What's your name? I'm Zoe McEwen. Hi, Zoe. Governor Brad Little's message today, a positive one. Teachers and government students getting a first-hand look at state politics in action. I think it's really an incredible opportunity for them to be able to meet, sit here, and mingle with um, the governor of the state. That's an opportunity that doesn't exist for most students. For me, it's really important to have our age to have a voice and to be able to know what's going on and to be able to have mature conversations, be able to talk with the older generations as I'm coming up and getting ready to vote and things like that. It's really exciting to be able to know what's going on. We hear about Brad Little all the time and, you know, actions that he's putting in, but it's good to put a face to these actions, you know. I've kind of heard of some of the programs that he's put in and they've already benefited me in my education. Governor Little assuring the future leaders that Idaho is in a better place now than it's ever been. We've got one of the strongest economies. We're first for income growth over every state. Uh, we're a top five state for employment growth. Uh, we've got record reductions in red tape. Um, we've got record investments in education, and this is a good setting to talk about those. Governor Little says that while much has been done, there is still much more to do. One of his main concerns this legislative session is to continue to fund our schools. One proposal is a new bond initiative that's outlined in his Idaho Works Plan. This one goes directly at helping school districts either pass a bond for a major renovation, a bond for a new school, a bond for significant uh, maintenance. Uh, this uh, legislation will do all of that. Another thing on the governor's radar, getting more students involved in the Idaho Launch Program. Launch makes, as you all know, up to $8,000 for two years to every single graduating senior. Right now, there's 22,000 of you in the state that will get your diplomas in May and uh, over 12,000 of them have signed up. Our biggest need, dire need in Idaho, is in the healthcare field. One out of 10 high school seniors has signed up to be somewhere in the healthcare field. And of course, Idaho State is where a lot of that, those educational opportunities take place. Now, Todd, as you can imagine, those students are very excited about that launch program and what it means for their future. We also had the chance after the meeting to talk one-on-one -on -one with Governor Little about some of the things that our viewers have said are important to them. I'll have information on that meeting coming up tonight at 10. Reporting live from Highland High School in Pocatello, I'm Linda Larson. All right, Linda, we will look forward to that later tonight at 10 o'clock. Thanks a lot.